Should Luki quarterbacks play or sit behind the starter for a while? During the National Football League meetings in March, reporters huddled around Sin Payton, one of football's quarterback Pelasper Kings. With the upcoming NFL draft, a primary focus, the Denver Bronx coach shared what would later become more than a fleeting thought about rookie quarterbacks. That's a topic that I see and read about sometimes, and you guys would know this, Peyton said inside a ballroom at the Orlando Rich Carlton. Is it better to sit behind the starter or get thrown into the fire? Peyton highlighted the Green Bay Packers lineage at Brett, Aaron, and the Jordan, and the benefits of the multi-year education, each replacement received by watching a long-time starter start, uh, still slinging at the peak of his power. That's uh, the invaluable, Peyton said, and yet there are times when you don't have that luxury. The quarry may have sounded purely hypothetical. Danbird's last rookie of the week, one starting quarterback, had been John Elway in 1983. Peyton, the former coach of the New Orleans Saints, had never opened a regular season with a first-year pass, passer on the center. One month later, with a roster without an obvious starter after the Broncos released Russell Wilson, a Super Bowl champion, but a poor pit for Peyton's scheme. The team selected Oregon's bowl Knicks with the 12th overall pick. Peyton's hypothetical about the start-to-sit debate, uh, one every franchise had faced over the decades, had become reality. Including Denver, six franchises in 2024 took a quarterback in the first round of the draft. Three started their rookies in week one. Next uh, the, for the Broncos, the number one overall pick, Caleb, uh, for the Chicago Bears, and the number two pick, Jaden, uh, for the Washington Commanders.